everybody and welcome back to my channel. Oh, I'm feeling slightly overwhelmed and a bit stressed today just because I have roguely, randomly booked a flight to Ibiza for tomorrow. I literally leave in 16 hours. My original plan was to go to Croatia however looked online and honestly the weather looked shocking so I was like right may as well go to Ibiza I'm going with a girlfriend of mine just a couple of days away just I need to get some good content I need to do a bit of work and also just to chill and get a bit of a tan I, I have barely been away this summer because I've been working non-stop I literally had a little trip to see Harvey's family at the beginning of summer like in June but other than that I haven't really done anything so I've got a free weekend this weekend and obviously it's bank holiday so I was like you know what let's live life on the edge girls so girls so girls so girls so in this video I do a little pack with me because well I don't know why to be honest with you and I'm so stressed and I'm literally so behind and I have minimal time till my flight but we move girls we move and I can't complain because realistically you know i'm stressing but it's it's all for a good cause you know i'm gonna be in the sun fingers crossed and yes for those wondering i went to get a pcr test done and i think that's what i need pcr lo passenger locator form and then when i fly back i need i don't know but i'm gonna figure that out when i get there because i feel like we don't need to worry about that just yet we'll figure that out We'll get to that point. I am going for four days and I can tell you I'm taking the world's biggest suitcase because I like to overpack and I like having options. And I feel like most girls will agree with me on that one. Personally, when I pack, I tend to do my bikinis, my socks and my underwear first. I don't know why, I just do. So I'm gonna pack quite a few different bikinis. I've kind of got them out here. I've got this one, which I absolutely adore a small like a new startup brand called bikini bible but the pattern on it is so nice so i'm packing this because i've not worn this yet these two i have already worn and filmed about um these are from summer swim and i love them and i'm gonna take this cute little cut out swimsuit I'm also going to take this swimsuit, quite cool, I'm thinking boat vibes, it's a bit different but kind of cool, and also just a white bikini and just a blue one. Yeah, I think I've got enough for four nights, that's for sure. Hair tool wise, at the moment I've got the GHD Tong, which I think is the 20 something mm. Uh, just in case you're wondering. I'm not actually going to take that one with me. I'm going to take my Dyson air wrap with me because I can put on the top to make it a blow dryer and it gives that nice beachy wave. And then I'm going to take my little mini GHDs, which are just portable, which are great for traveling. Is that all I'm, is that enough? Yeah, that'll be enough, won't it? If not, we'll go El Natural and I'll look like Monica, Monica from Friends. So, pop you up slightly. Oh my God, if you guys could see what I'm using as my bloody tripod right now it's actually quite funny also please excuse the state of my room you know how it is when you're packing what i just show you some outfits i mean i've kind of planned my outfits but realistically firstly i probably won't stick to any of it secondly i'm just kind of packing like i've kind of got an idea but slash i don't because i'm trying to be organized and i'm just not just thought i'd show you a few of my favorite bits so this i haven't actually worn yet but i've been wanting to wear it for so long i think it's called from fluke the label um, and it's this like, I mean, this is really not doing it any justice in actual fact. I'm probably just like making people not buy it. Uh, <laughs> but it's this like crochet long maxi dress, which like comes up here. Stunning stuff, girls. Like, this is quite rogue, but I think this with a black bag and black heels will actually look really cute on a night out. Again, you can't really see what it is, but it's like this ruffled... I don't even know. I love this long skirt. This is from Nasty Girl. It's super cheap. I got it this summer. It's really nice just to go with a white bikini over the top and a cool little hat and loads of jewellery. They're the vibes she's going for. I love these trousers that I got from Zara. They're like waffly material, which are going to be so cute with a pair of sandals and even just a bikini, like bikini top type vibe or even like a crochet top. Or I've got this one here like a 
little, you know? I'm feeling like these boho chic vibes in Ibiza. I've got some bits from PLT, which I'm taking. This really nice top, which goes like that, which I thought could be cool if I do end up going on any nights out. I think this trip's gonna be slightly different, which I'm kind of looking forward to. It's gonna be like chilled, nice dinners, cocktails, that kind of vibe. I mean, let's see. I'm gonna take you guys along with me to Ibiza because I am going to uh, vlog it for you all. So let's see how we get on. I mean, I won't bother showing you absolutely every single item I'm taking because to be honest with you, half the stuff you've seen all on my hauls anyway. For example, this dress, this is just the Zara Maxi. Um, that I got a while ago, but I thought we'll give that one a go. We'll recycle that get that one out This is also just this is a very good investment from Zara as well This is just like a tiny little tennis dress and it's just plain. It's just black. It's simple, but very very Effective. I mean it goes with anything hugs the figure And yeah, I mean I'm currently sitting in a pile of clothes So I'm gonna quickly like pack all these up and then yeah show you a few extra bits also actually i know this is pathetic but i'm actually quite sad this will be my first trip without harvey that i've ever been on <laughs> honestly i need to get a grip but he's going to spain to a family wedding or not a family wedding a friend's wedding um with all of his family and stuff and i was like well i'm not being left in england so i'm off honey and it's gonna be quite weird. I mean, I'm only going, he's going tomorrow as well, but gets back a day later than me. And I'm staying my, at my friend's tonight because her house is way closer to the airport that I'm going to in the morning. So it's like five days without him and a trip without him. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's gonna be lovely to have some girly time. And I think it is very important to do that, but I'm quite sad. I feel a bit like, I don't know. I feel a bit weird about it. <laughs> I need to grow up. I need to grow up. Oh, that looks good, doesn't it? okay so i feel like i'm slowly getting somewhere thank god shoes wise i'm literally gonna take two pairs of heels i got these little mule type ones from just river island they're pretty cheap and these lovely prada ones which i got from vista i feel like all this stuff you've probably seen in my <laughs> videos anyway these little christian dior ones very very like comfy and go with everything as well and i really like them that's enough and then a pair of trainers and that will do me for shoes bag wise i'm taking this bottega bag which is a little treat that i got for myself a couple of months ago it's with everything like everything and this little mini prad one also it's so good for little trips because again goes with everything and it's really like easy to pack because it's nylon this is going to be my airport bag because it's really big but also my beach bag which is my prada which oh still got the tag on it from vista village where i got this it was 890 pounds what was I thinking? Because it's already getting dirty and I haven't even worn it. So, oh, hang on. Surely I didn't pay that for it. I think that was the original price. I'm pretty sure I paid 500 and something, if I'm honest. But it comes with a really cute pouch as well. So that will be my little beach bag. This is, I am going to take so many sunnies. Watch me take a pair for every single day because I'm obsessed. I've got these gorgeous ones with this chain which will take me about four hours to deconstruct but oh easier than what i thought these jimmy fairly ones i got them at the beginning of summer i'm still loving them these with the chain on bit of me cute little chain with pearls on it i look really hot and sweaty this room is like boiling these i they're like cheap as hell i do not know where i got them from but they're giving me like are they wonky? Oh, okay, maybe they're a bit wonky. These are giving me, you know, pretty woman vibes. I am Julia Roberts's twin right now, if um, you can't tell the resemblance. It's uncanny. Oh yeah, but then again, I got these ones from Saint, ow, fuck. That hurt, from Saint Laurent, much the same. I don't know, maybe I look like something from Matrix with these on. 
Oh my god, I've also just realised how wonky you are. I think it's actually the camera that's wonky, not my bloody sunglasses. Oh my god. Are they three? Are they three pairs? I swear I've got another pair. Okay, I'll probably take maybe these ones. These are the cute, are they cute called, what are they called? Taylor Hugo, Mor Hugo Morris, I fuck knows. But maybe I'll take those with me. And yeah, that's about it for the uh, for the accessories part of things. Okay, so this is pretty much it. I also just packed some nice little jewelry bits in this little cute travel case, which is from Stackers. It's got my initials on, Harvey actually got it for me. So yeah, I'm feeling quite organized. Um, I've definitely overpacked because I am only going for four days. And do you want to see the aftermath of what I'm gonna have to deal with quickly now? Oh my god. Do you know what? I think what I'm gonna do is actually just leave it until I get back. Well, I'm just gonna stuff it all in my wardrobe, leave it until I get back. And then when I get back, I'm gonna have a massive wardrobe clear out and put so much stuff on Depop because I hate all my clothes. I've got to that point where I'm just like, I don't like anything in my bloody wardrobe anymore. And I'm gonna donate some to charity as well. So yeah, look out for that gang. Oh guys, wish me luck. It's been real. I hope you've enjoyed my packing with me. I'm gonna literally finish tidying my room now and getting the last bits together. Fingers crossed we make it because I feel like traveling right now in this whole current climate is just a complete nightmare. But you know what? We're gonna give it a shot and if it's meant to be, it will meant it's meant to be. How cute is this ring? Completely off topic. This little one, it's meant to go on this pinky, but it's too big. And who likes my little nails? I just got my nails and my toes done. Holiday colours, right? I'm so hot, honestly. Right now, it's I've got some width. Like I can't, I can't even concentrate. I don't know what's going on. Oh, I'm not dramatic at all, but right, off I go. Goodbye. <laughs>